COBE is a specification which outlines certain types of data which must be present in an IFC file in order for that data to be useful for facility management. And the Blender BIM add-on is actually capable of producing an IFC which contains all of that COBE data compliant to the specification. But that's rather complex, but I'm not going to talk about that today. Instead, I'm going to talk about an alternative way of presenting COBE data, which is in a spreadsheet format. The spreadsheet format is also documented in this guide, which tells you what type of worksheets you should have, as well as what types of data should exist in each worksheet. But more importantly, it explains how that data relates to the original IFC data set, because the spreadsheet is meant to be used as an alternative to the IFC and only contains a subset of the information that's present in the IFC file. This is documented in the specification here. It explains that this type of data must come from this type of IFC entity, and these are the various instructions you must follow when extracting that data out of IFC and placing it in a spreadsheet format. And since the spreadsheet format is just a subset of the IFC data, that means once you convert from IFC into a spreadsheet format, you can't convert it back because it only contains a small portion of the information and has undergone a series of processing as uh, outlined here. The COBE specification also outlines what elements it regards as maintainable assets. For example, it considers a door to be a maintainable asset, whereas it does not consider a column to be a maintainable asset. In the Blender BIM add-on, I've got a small file loaded up here as an example. On the right-hand side, in the scene properties, there's a panel that says IFC COBE. This allows me to select an IFC file, for example, the one I have up on my screen, and then press one of these three buttons in order to convert it into a spreadsheet format. The templates provided online are usually provided in an Excel format, but the COBE plugin in the Blender BIM add-on also allows you to export into ODS and CSV formats. Just press the button that you're interested in, and then it will generate the spreadsheet. It will also generate a log along with the spreadsheet. This is what the spreadsheet looks like, and it's what you might expect. You can see that all of the components have been brought in that it's considered to be maintainable. You'll notice that no walls or columns have been brought in, even though that there were walls in the file. You'll also notice that the created by column seems to have some rather odd data into it. Similarly, over here, you can see the same strange processing of the data. That's because this file comes from Autodesk Revit. At the same time, the COBE standard explains how to process the created by information. It says that if no email address is found, then this is the structure which should be provided, and unknown should be used in place of each one of these tokens whenever they're empty. This gives us the very strange output where we have a given name of deluxe with unknown at unknown. This might seem strange, but it's following to the letter exactly how Kobe was specified. During the process, it also produces a huge text file of every single oddity it found while processing the IFC file to convert it into a Kobe spreadsheet. As you can see, it found lots of problems.